5 seconds once again we have had a long debate on some of the important issues which are facing the country from the beginning honorable members have given many useful suggestions and there has also been much criticism in fact our government is open to receive healthy criticism because that is one of the ways of finding out our shortcomings any government facing the great challenge of lifting the country from one age to another much chalk out new courses and in that process there has to be certain amount of risk taken but in spite of these shortfalls and mistakes our country has been steadily going forward one honorable member has stated that the policies of our government could break up the country but i would like to make it clear that our party do not wish to break up the country you are aware that our party stood first in the freedom struggle and fought against the british rule in the country one of the most urgent problems to which most members made reference and for which we in the government as individuals and as ministers have the deepest concern is the hardship that is being caused because of the drought in some parts of the country it is not a matter which one can ignore and the shortage is not merely due to food grains but it is also due to fodder and drinking water we have a long term policy for the areas which are dependent on rainfall the dry areas development program gives special attention for increasing the food production now we have to look into the matter from the point of view increasing the food production so that people do not face difficulties merely because of the weather in this connection i would like to assure the honorable members that we have equal concern for every state of the country as i said earlier this is an issue on which we must all regardless of our other differences should unitedly help those who are suffering i would like to appeal to the members of the opposition to our party members and even those who do not belong to any party not to consider this as a political matter some honorable members have expressed doubts about the efficiency of the working of our takeover of the wholesale trade i do not want to go into details here but every step is being taken to see that the work is done efficiently and that the best possible people are used for it the question of employment is a major one i do not want to go into the whole question here but it is sometimes felt that the special programs which we have taken in hand have not worked now this is not true when a new program is introduced naturally it will take some time to achieve some results in parliament and outside we hear about the need for reforms whether it is administrative reform or educational reform the government of india is determined to go ahead with administrative reforms on a large scale for a long time there is the question of developing people belonging to minorities community and we have to stop the atrocities against the minorities in my view there are two aspects of the problem there is the human aspect individuals suffering because of difficulties either of religion or of not having sufficient places in the service the second part is that in a nation which faces challenges 
cannot afford to have any community neglected. All of us should fight against this problem. Letter from Raghu Stationers, Gandhi Chowk, Kammam to Ravi Booksellers, Abbots, Hyderabad. Dear Sirs, we are in receipt of your letter, dated 10th instant, wherein you have expressed your interest in purchasing all your requirements, such as textbooks, notebooks of schools and colleges, along with other stationary items. In this connection, we appreciate your desire to place your regular orders from us. As desired by you, we have taken special interest in sending quotation and we have that after going through the same, you will be happy to note that the rates quoted by us are much cheaper compared to other wholesale dealers in the market. You are aware that we are dealing in selling all kinds of textbooks and notebooks for different use of the students. The prices quoted by us are subject to change from time to time. However, at present, we will charge the rates as per the quotation sent to you. Further, we would like to inform you that this year onwards, we have also started dealing with New Year diaries, calendars and seasons greeting cards and we are enclosing here with the price list along with samples. We hope that the quality of our products and the rates will impress you. As a special case, we will allow 30 days credit on all the orders placed by you, hoping to receive an early order from you. Yours faithfully, Managing Director.